Hello, I'm going to show you how to add business hours to your site. It's very simple. Let's do it. So we look on the left hand side where it says pages and you'll find a business hours in two different areas. You'll find it underneath popular on the far right and also under business in the same area. So I'm just going to drag this, drop it in and let it go. That is the drag and drop. If I don't want to see the title, I can hide that. If I want to uh, call it something else, business hours for now. I could call it that way too. So I can build my own business hours or I can find them online. So I'll click on here. Here's the phone number. I'm actually going to erase that number there. I'm going to say stepping out Florida. And you can name anything you want to. Will it find it? It may or may not. Here we go. Here's New Jersey. Here's Mississippi, Jenny's Steakhouse, and it's found different ones. So it's what it mostly will do, if it can find your number or your business hours, excuse me, on the site, then it knows exactly what to do. So uh, I'm pretending that this is it, like it found it, and as you see, it did populate. But I know, you know, really did not find it. So I'm going to go back here, and I want to show you exactly how to build it yourself. So if I go build my own business hours, We'll give it a moment. Choose your language. Choose the start day week. And then we have either standard or military time. Now you could go by single where you open and close. Maybe you have an hour off. Maybe you open, close, and open, close again. Maybe you're closed. Maybe you're open 24 hours. Maybe you're by appointment only. Many, many, many different options here. As you scroll down, we'll see that we have our weekend. And we can also combine the days when opening hours are similar. So let's just say this is 5 to 10. As you see, that's already happened. Monday through Saturday, 5 to 10. But if you want to change it, all you have to do is change this. Maybe this day is 9 o'clock p.m. to 10 p.m. And as you see, it's set my Monday above the others. So I know on Monday that I'm open from 9 to 10 p.m., but Tuesday through Saturday is from 5 to 10. Now, as I go here to design, I can look at the background color. There's nothing there. Maybe a background image, or I can add in even the border. The effects, I can add a shadow to it. I can round out the corners to it as well. But, as many people know, I like straight edges. Looking at more, I could change my padding, my margin. I can even mess around the CSS with this. Alright, going back to general. Actually, let's go to design. Text style. I know we're at 16. I know it's dark, it's black. Let's go ahead and lighten this up just a little bit. Okay. So the color of the text is a different color. Let's go for let's go for black. Hmm. Well, you know, if you see the title and you see the body, maybe one's hard to read. We can still work around that, and I'll show you how. We'll turn it black. We'll come up here to design or general. Excuse me. Pick up new business hours. Now I want to hide this top bar. So now I can see my hours in my day right here. So what I'm going to do now is I want to go find my title. Let's look at our design here and let's go find title. We'll just take title, drag it in, and I will say business hours. And I do see that the border of this business hours is on top of my hours of operation. So I'm just going to go here to more and I'm going to add in some margin. And maybe I want the top margin a little bit open as well. So there we go. Here's business hours. 
I may want to even center that a little bit. Let's go to text. Let's go to center. And maybe, just maybe, I want to add a border. So I go to design here. This border, I want to add one. It's a bit bright. So let's go tone that down a little bit. Okay. And uh, maybe I don't want it too far away. Maybe I should change it 10 to a 5. And done. So as you see, I have business hours and the hours below it. You could definitely read it. And you can see that there is a little bit of border around the business hours. This low type of purple goes pretty well with the darker purple. It's a good contrast and it's very legible. And that's exactly what I would want to show my customers or the viewers who come to my website. So that is actually how to work with your business hours. Don't forget to look at all the other videos that we have. And if we do have a way for you to, to subscribe to our videos, please do that as well too. Thank you very much.